Hi everyone, this video is about a witch who runs a restaurant and grants the witches of the customs with a special dish. In return, they must sacrifice the most valuable thing in their lives, even with body parts. This is a South Korean web drama called The Witch Dinner. In the description and end of the video, there will be a list of original soundtracks, don't miss it. And of course, this video without spoilers for the ending. If you like this video format, then subscribe and like it. Thank you for attention, then let's get started. The story begins with the fact that we are shown a witch who fulfills human desires by preparing special dishes for people. If you have been surrendering unfairly fired from your job, or a black streak of continuous failures has begun in your life, you are here. An inviting sign, the sound of a doorbell, and now you are already crossing the threshold of the witch's restaurant. Welcome, but be careful, you will have to pay a big price for the fulfillment of a dream. John Jin never complained about life. She endured and endured. Once she was fired from her job. She was dumped by a guy who dated her for five years. And the relationship ended about five minutes. John Jin couldn't hide it for long. The loving mother quickly understood everything and consoled her daughter as best she could. Now, for a girl free from all applications, new prospects have opened up. Why not invest in a profitable business and open your own restaurant secured by real estate? There are no risks and the institution already has a client base. This is exactly what John Jin and her mother thought when they gave the last money to a dishonest neighbor. Outraged, John Jin goes to the police to file a complaint against the scrummer. After a bit of fight with a policeman, she becomes a witness to the discrimination of two high school students, a bad attitude since the guys were from single parent families and stands off for them. Coming out into the air from the Staffy Falls station, she meets one of the students. After talking a little, both of them felt a little better at heart. By that time, it turns out that John Jin's father has health problems and her mother must go to him. John Jin is left to contemplate what to do with the burnout restaurant. On the threshold of an almost bankrupt institution, a spectacular lady suddenly appears, ready to buy it. It turned out to be a witch named Jo Hira. She offers herself as a restaurant owner in exchange for a witch. John Jeans agrees. It can't be said that at that time she was of sound mind and memory. But if it is possible, she decided it to take revenge on the neighbor who deceived them. The witch cooked her a steak and said, when you show, think about the person you want to take revenge on and there is no turning back. The same night, the swindler Scarmel dies of a heart attack and from the moment John Jin's witch came true, she begins to see herself at night as a child and some strange woman in black. In the morning she thought it was a dream, but it turned out that her witch came true. The witch takes over the restaurant from John Jin and opens her own. Jo Hira is going to cook dishes that fulfill the desires of customers but in return for this, she will take that she wants from customers. Now, 
Jin must not only transfer the restaurant into the position of the witch, but also undertakes to work for her. While all of this was going on with Jin, in another part of town, a high school student named Li Gyulyong also fell into despair. He was a promising athlete, but after the injury, a sports career remained only a pipe dream. However, he realistically looked at life and chose a future profession that was close to his passion for sport. And he also has a heightened sense of justice. He can easily fight the offenders of his classmate without fear of getting into the, the pose for it. The reason he meets Jane. After that, they already met several times by chance. But one day, there were no customers in the restaurant all day. In the evening, one came, and it was Li Gilyong. He came in by accident. John Jin spoke with Li Gilyong to choose his wish responsibly, as the consequences are unpredictable. But he assured her that everything would be alright, and no one would suffer from his desire. To John Jin's surprise, the witch, after feeding Li Gilion a delicious witch granting soup, hired the boy as a part assistant. So now they will work and meet clients together. The witch began to involve John Jin in cooking, especially after she noticed that Jin could read magical inscriptions on jars. While running the witch's errands, Jin meets various people. Some ones the cute seem stupid and some ones impredictable, but each of the visitors will undoubtedly face retribution. After all, a real witch doesn't tolerate the tours and will definitely take what is due to her. But suddenly, Jo Hura's restaurant became popular. Which Jo Hura is an excellent cook. All her clients and animosity claimed that they had never tasted anything tastier than her dishes in their lives. And because these dishes had an addictive power, she often reminded workers that they shouldn't eat prepared for customers, even leftovers. But one day, Jin couldn't resist and disobeyed the order. What will happen to her next? In the drama, almost every episode is a separate new story about how much people get what they want. Some of the stories are even intertwined and the characters are intertwined. They are all different and each has a secret desire. As promised, the list of original soundtracks. If you like this video, please subscribe and like it. Thank you for your attention. Have a nice day.